very concerned about them. It concerns me a little bit. I'm actually, no. It concerns me very much. I do definitely think that is of concern and should be looked further into. The only concerns I have is if the documents is going to jeopardize the United States citizens and our health and well-being. That's when it becomes a problem. I'm concerned that he's hiding something about um, his financial dealings with Ukraine and China and his son's hunters as well. Yeah, the only concern I have is that I hope they straighten that up because I believe he's been planted. And I don't think he'd have been that uh, naive to have that in, in his office. Maybe there's a greater good to it. Maybe he needs to have an explanation for it. But somebody will get to the bottom of it eventually, just like with Donald Trump. Because of the Trump situation, I think it's been escalated, blown out of proportion. Uh, I am a Democrat, and I voted for Biden. But I don't like the way this is going down. My concern is when they do something about ex-president Trump's. Expedited Karin no longer wants to answer questions on classified documents. Guys, you can ask me this hundred times if you wish. I'm going to keep saying the same thing. I hear your question. It's been asked. It's been answered. Karin decided she will no longer answer questions. Guys, you guys can ask me this a hundred times, two hundred times if you wish. I'm going to keep saying the same thing. I hear your question. It's been asked. It's been answered. It's been noted. And we're just going to try to move on here. She continued, America should not be outraged that classified documents were found in Bidan garage because Bidan said that he didn't know and said that he take classified information and document very seriously. There are some series of videos I came across. I'll play some so you can see exactly what is going on. If you have not subscribed to this channel, please endeavor to do that. And if possible, why not share this clip? My response to it all is that alleged classified documents showing up allegedly in the possession of, uh, of uh, Joseph Biden. Uh, you know, I mean, there's so much that needs to be um investigated and um and that's that's what i call for is for everything to be investigated but i'm suspicious of the timing of it i'm i'm also aware of the fact that things can be planted on people P places and things can be planted um or things things can be planted in places uh, and then discover it conveniently, that may be what has occurred here. I'm not ruling that out, but I don't, I'm, I'm open in terms of the investigation needs to be. We're gonna send a, a, a subpoena for you. He said, on that's a subpoena. Right. That's right. Okay? That's why they raided his house. Now, it's, if we all know, you're right, this needs to be investigated, but it is not the same. I'm sorry. But it is being all... investigated. But why? Yes. Uh, the AG yeah. appointed John Lausch, a Trump appointee, to review Maybe they missed that. how the classified material ended up in Biden's home and former office. So when they keep calling for this, they're creating this optic that it's not being looked into. Yeah. And that is being looked into. And I do see the difference in the sense that when you look at a character like uh, former President Trump and then you look at President Biden, anyone with... Something can be planted on people that is very big. He is suspecting that this has been planted. But there is a question. I keep seeing this on social media. Even Jim Jordan is questioning what is going on. He said, why suddenly now? This is a question that should be passing through your brain. There is something these people are cooking that people don't realize. Just to follow up, if I can, very quickly on this. The White House says Republicans are faking outrage on this issue. Why shouldn't Americans be outraged about classified documents being found in a garage? Look, and I think I've been very clear about this. We have answered questions on this at this podium. You've heard, as Phil was saying twice from the president, talk about this. He said that he didn't know. Right? He said that he was surprised, and he said that he takes classified information and documents very, very seriously. We heard directly from the president 
on this issue. Now, anything else, anything beyond that, uh, we're just not going to talk about. There's an investigation going on. There's a legal process here, as we've been very, very clear about. Uh, I will let the White House counsel uh, talk about any specific details uh, about that. Uh, but we're going to be prudent here and make sure that we are not uh, interfering in this process. The White House has suddenly decided not to take questions pertaining to what is happening when this same situation was happening to the former president, I remember every day she was responding to questions pertaining to this. Three weeks straight. But now she is deviating away from this, saying we should move on. We are not moving on. There is still a lot to be done. I don't know what you think about this. Drop under the comment section. Let me know. What are your thoughts? I've never Trump. seen a, a luckier person than Donald Trump. Just as we're this close well, to getting him, but you somehow know these but it, documents you know what, appear. But here's the thing. Biden is wrong to have done this. He, he was in office wrong. for well, 40 let's years. Find, he let's that. find out what this is first. Now, again, mm. one of the things That's that gets true. me crazy is before we know, it's already been spun a specific yeah. way. I don't want to see that. The, I want to see... Someone explain to me, A, how it's possible that after all this time, nobody yeah. knew this. Because to me, if you're missing classified information, I don't mean to laugh, but in my house, does, if stuff is missing, I know it's missing. Does it missing. feel like oppo research to you? Does it feel like the Republicans are behind it? It's I, not. I it did originally, but I'm sorry, sorry. but not, not now. Because one of the things, one of the things he's saying is that, you know, some of these, some of the locations, this is a distraction because they have teetered people away from the real issues plaguing this country. Every day, talking about classified documents, CNN recently had an interview with Joe where he rejected to take questions. For what are you talking about? Yes, taking a look at Whoopi, Whoopi seems to be disturbed. Why suddenly now? And Sonny Hostin is suggesting that Republicans can be behind this. Like you saw at the beginning of the clip where this lawmaker is actually being very optimistic, saying something can be planted. 